Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to see packaging concepts in SAP MM and SD. That is, I am going to buy a packaging material from a vendor and then in, during in the SD part, I am going to sell a material to the customer. During the delivery of the material, I am going to pack with the procured material and sell it to the customer and build the customer. So that is what I am going to do. So for that, I am going to create a packaging material and then I am going to purchase do purchase order, goods receipt and invoice certification. That is, I am going to buy the packaging material from the vendor and then I am going to during the selling of a material, I am going to pack that material and sell to the customer and build the customer. So let's go to SAP system, live system. Now I am going to create a material, MM01. Packaging material, it's going to be packaging material. Select packaging material, see here, present, present. Wooden pellets. Wooden pellets. Each base unit of measure, each. Enter material group, enter, press enter. So this is item category group is VERP packaging verp okay present end availability check zero transportation group and loading group select loading present purchasing group triple zero no mr nd no mr so before that i haven't selected a small go to basic data one scroll down the basic data one select material group packing material pg10 so what do you mean by what is pg10 let me select from here pg10 is pellet type a okay now go to sales general plan select packaging material type pellets now save it Plan delivery time one day. Two one six seven six eight. Two one six eight is my material now. Go to now. I'm going to buy it from outside. Go to ME twenty one yen. Select vendor. Enter purchase organization. Purchasing group. Enter material two one six eight. 2168. Enter quantity. Quantity 100 quantity. I'm going to put 100 quantity. 100 quantity. 100 quantity. 100. Sorry. Enter net weight and gross weight. Sorry. Enter net price. 1100 rupees. Enter plan. 1111. Storage location double one double one and save it and save it. Now I'm going to do goods result for this. Goods result. Go to slash and MIGO slash and MIGO goods result. I'm going to do goods result. Goods result. Enter the purchase order number. Scroll down, item OK and post. Item OK and post. Now, I have done goods also. That is, vendor has sent the wooden pallets to the company. Now, I want to build the vendor. Build the vendor. Okay, now go to slash and MIR. Slash and MIR. Okay, enter the invoice date. Enter tax code, calculate tax, enter PO number. Now I have entered the PO number. I'm going to post the invoice, vendor invoice. Now we enter this balance amount 100111000. And enter the baseline date, the date before which we have to pay the, pay the payment. Now post it. Now I am going to buy a material from sales order from 
I am going to sell a material to the customer. Go to, go to VA01. OR is my order type. Sales organization 1111, distribution channel 11, division 11. Enter, sold to party. Payment terms and import terms. Enter payment terms and import terms. Enter the material. This is my material. Quantity 1. Double click onto this line item. Go to shipping. Enter plant. Storage location. Net weight and gross weight. Let me enter the net weight and gross weight. Net weight is 1 kg. And gross weight. Enter the gross weight. And save it. Now let me save this. So I have done the order confirmation with the customer. So that is, I'm going to sell the material to the customer. This material, 2157 to the customer. Now I'm going to deliver it to the customer by with the packaging material. Go to bl one n Enter shipping 1000. Enter selection date. Select onto this line item, pack, CL, pack. So what is my packing material? My packing material is 2106. 2168, sorry, 2168 is my packaging unit. Press enter. See, handling units. 7502. Select onto this and pack. Click onto this pack material. Pack, pack button. This is pack button. So, material pack. See here? Material pack. Material pack. Now, close this. Let me close this. Come back and let me do post goods issue. Go to picking, enter, quantity, post goods issue. Click on to this post goods issue. So I have done post goods issue. Now go to BF01, BF01 for billing. Now save it. Let me save this. Let's go and see the document flow. Go to BA03 and let's see the document flow. See here? This is my sales order. Let me see the document flow. See here? I have created a sales order, done the billing, and handling units is packing. I have done the packing. I have done the packing. Post goods issue, done the post goods issue, and build the customer. So, this is how we do packaging in SAP. Thank you.